Hello everybody. This is Dr. Y. S. Syed Khader, Department of Physics, K. S. R. College of Arts and Science, Bar Women, Tirchangodu. Today, let us see the different mechanical properties of engineering materials, the practical application of engineering material in manufacturing. Engineering depends upon a through knowledge on their particular properties under a wide range of condition. For each and every material, we should know their unique properties. Then only we can able to manipulate on that particular material. The term property is a qualitative or quantitative measure of response of material to the externally imposed condition like forces and temperature. However, the range of properties found in different classes of materials is very large. The classification of materials, uh, material properties, chemical, physical, mechanical, and uh, dimensional properties are there. Let us see one by one. Mechanical property: the properties of material that determine its behavior under applied forces are known as mechanical properties. they are usually related to elastic and plastic behavior of the materials these properties are expressed as a function of stress and strain a sound knowledge on mechanical properties of material provides the basis for predicting the behavior of the material under different load condition and designing the components out of them about stress and strain it depends upon the magnitude of load applied to the material nature of the material cross sectional dimension strength the strength of material is its capacity to withstand destruction under the action of external loads it determines the ability of a material to withstand stress without failure the maximum stress that any material with withstand before destruction is called ultimate strength elasticity we know about the elasticity if we apply force on the material after removing the force the material will come to its original position that is elasticity the property of a material by which you of which deformation causes by applied load disappears upon removal of the load it is shown in the diagram see in the first diagram normal stress is given applied force and if the force is removed it will goes to the normal position this is mentioned in the third figure plasticity the plasticity of a material is the ability to undergo some degree of permanent deformation without rupture or failure plastic deformation will take only after the elastic limit is exceeded it increases with increase in temperature stiffness the resistance of a material to elastic deformation or deflection is called stiffness or rigidity example we can give steel beam is more stiffer or more rigid than aluminum beam ductility so it is a property of a material which enables it to draw out into thin wire example mild steel is a ductile material we can make a thin wires out of it malleability malleability of a material is its ability to flatten into thin sheets without cracking by hot or cold working example lead can be readily rolled and hammered into thin sheets but can be drawn into wires hardness how hard the material hardness is a fundamental property which is closely related to strength hardness is usually defined in term of the ability of a material to resist to scratching abrasion cutting indentation or penetration so methods used for determining hardness brink rockwell wickern wickerness uh, study is there through which we can uh, measure the hardness of a material brittleness it is the property of breaking 
without much permanent distortion non ductile material is considered to be brittle material example glass cast iron etc so these are all the mechanical properties of a engineering material thank you